Oh god, I do not want to get hit by that more than once. Oh, okay, I got hit by that more than- Oh no. Wait, does that count as a boss of a dungeon? Oh, oh no. No. No, I'm, I'm dead. No. No. All right, we're back. Um, remove it. Wait, leave it. Okay, we're back here. At here, we've already been here. And what the fuck? What happened to my armor? What happened to this horse's armor? I mean, what the? T -t you're not armored anymore. And what the hell are you wearing, Fando? Wait, what the hell am I wearing? Yes, I have downloaded a couple mods, and thanks to a very, very, very helpful uh, viewer of this show, I was able to get a updated version of Skyrim, which allowed me to pretty much get a couple mods working. Uh, this specific one that Feindel is wearing is called the Chief's Armor Mod. I pretty much just went to Whiterun and used some of the materials that I already had to make this. And the same with this Dovahkiin mercenary armor that I'm wearing. Um, I hope I don't get, like, ex or I hope I don't, or YouTube doesn't get too mad at me for wearing this bot. Ah, uh, I got this mod and I was like, yes. Because originally when I was making my dark elf, or my wood elf, I thought I would make the most ugly freaking girl character in the world. And then it turned into this because of mods. So, yeah. I'm I'm perfectly normal. It's you that's weird, Fando. But yes. There was a ruin over here that I wanted to explore. Back this way. And I've sworn to explore it. Because I saw it on my map marker. Oh. Oh, right. That's right. Alright. Alright. So, I didn't... I got two things, pretty much. Okay, let's just go into the items section here. I got the Dovahkiin Mercenary Bow, which is kind of overpowered, I'm not gonna lie. But I'm still only using those, so... Okay, we're going to weapons. Dovahkiin Mercenary Bow. Of course, I have everything else before this. And then we go into stuff like this. Arr, the armor is kind of overpowered. Yeah, I know. I know that armor is really overpowered. But I have it on superior setting. Or superior upgrades. So I don't know what. Uh, I lost my train of thought. Anyways. <laughs> um, yeah. No, it looks like that's it. Up on top of the thing, of course. Of course I can't get to it from down here. That'd be way too easy. Way too easy. So now I'm gonna need to find a way up. Oh, Horker. It's coming after the Horker. Oh no, it's coming after me. Really freaking slowly. <laughs> I'm moving backwards faster than it moves forwards. And of course now we have arrow finishing moves and I think spell finishing moves because I have upgraded. Which is wonderful. Grass pod. And of course I have still have the better uh I still have the better waters going on in the new lighting EMB thing that's going on and that that looks wonderful. I love that. Chew, chew. Oh, it looks like there's condonium or whatever that is over here. And yes, I know the comments I'm gonna get for wearing this armor. Either they're gonna be really good or really bad, but oh well, this is what you get. Wonderful, aren't I? 
just just know that it's just an armor. I mean, I could probably wear 10,000 different armors. This was just one that I was just like, hey, this has kind of overpowered settings. I mean, I, I don't know what Daedra armor is like. I should probably look it up to get a reference, you know, just, just to see because Daedra armor is apparently the best armor in the game. In the dragon scale, obviously. But, you know, there there's a debate about it. A really big ongoing debate. So yeah. <laughs> ah, what is this? Looks like that's part of the thing that fell down. Oh, it looks like here's the entrance over here. It's right. Oh god, what the hell is that? Wildcat. Oh yes, I have the more uh, more monsters on or whatever it is, more sky monsters or something like that, and it adds a whole bunch of new monsters into the game, uh, namely uh, mostly things that are good for my level, like wildcats. Uh, I think there's cyclopses and a whole bunch of other stuff, like different kinds of skeletons, and apparently it's horrifying. Ah. Oh. But I'm looking forward to it because I downloaded this mod specifically for the people who said, Hey, we want to see you do more scary things. Because apparently people love seeing me scared witless. And there's some Nord arrows for me. Oh, it looks like there's one other thing over here. Oh. Fainda. Oh, looks like there was a skeleton here. Wait, there's something over here. I want to see what it is. Looks like a table of offerings. Take that orcish dagger. Um, doesn't look like there's anything else here, so let's just go, go back this way. <laughs> that was interesting for nothing. I'll hurry up. Oh yes, I also got the advanced uh, O F U or whatever it is that makes followers better. The optimized follower UI or something like that. Anyways, I I, I got a couple of mods on. Oh. God. Oh god. Okay, um, items, weapons, uh, uh, timbers. Oh, Z dodge for days. Z dodge for days. Z dodge for days. Oh god. Oh, okay. Okay, not cool. Faint up. Faint up. Faint up. Magic. Okay, let's go to rest. No, restoration. Okay. Oh god. Oh god, do not want to get hit by that more than once. Oh, oh, okay, I got hit by that more than- Oh no. Wait, does that count as a boss of a dungeon? I'm gonna count that as a boss of a dungeon. Cause that was crazy. <laughs> oh my god. Okay, I guess I should probably talk about this now then. Um, I guess I can because now. Okay. So, obviously, this was a challenge playthrough, even though it's heavily modded, you know, I did want a challenge for my playthrough of the game. You know, let's just go back to Winterhold, yes. Um, and the challenge basically is that I can't die. Ever. Well, there are a couple of exceptions. One, if I don't make it to level 10, 
uh, mostly because I want to explore the character, I want to, you know, have at least some time with the character, and that would be going to level 10 for me. So, uh, of course I am above level 10, so, but uh, the other one is I can die to uh, dungeon bosses, and that's pretty much like at the end of Bleak Fault Barrows, you get a boss of the Droger Death Knight or whatever it is, Death you know, Lord. Winterhold used to be. Can you believe that this hold used to contend for the throne of the High King? Now perhaps others will listen. Here, your reward is promised. You have Winterhold's thanks. There is room in my court for a new thane. It's an honorary title, mainly. But there are a few perks, somewhat. However, I could only grant the title to someone. You help my people. Good luck to you. Alright, so now I need to help people I... in the hold. And, you know, just do things that people generally like. Staying safe, I hope? <clears throat> um... So yes, I can't die uh, after I turn level 10 at all, unless it's to a boss of a dungeon, and at the end of Bleakfall Barrows you get a boss that, uh, at the end of the dungeon you get a boss that would be the Droger Death Knight, the Droger, whatever it is, the Droger Death something, Death Lord, Death whatever. Anyways, that basically in short means that that one didn't count, and that, m well mostly because the bosses of dungeons are actually really freaking difficult. I'll sell just about anything if it's worth my time. Uh, Keep that. I do what's necessary so we can get by. Have to. It's very. I'm sure you've known. So I'll sell whatever I can. I've been burned a few times. Made a few bad deals. Uh, most talking about something about it. I shouldn't have believed the story and just refused. Some line about this claw thing in Ingol Barrow. He said it was worth more than its weight in gold if I took it back there. Something about placing it back in Ingol's chamber, I don't know. What was I thinking? Even if it were true, I'm not setting foot in some ancient tomb filled with who knows what. I could look into it for I you. I don't even care anymore. You want to check it out? Fine. I'll sell you the thing for 50 gold and then it's your problem. Alright, let's do it. And then we get the dragon the claw. But I suppose if it does actually turn out to be worth something, let me know, will you? Some may call this junk. Me, I call them treasures. Alright, so we're gonna sell nothing apparently, because I don't have anything. Oh yeah, I sold everything already. But I do have stuff like lingering damage, potion of power, oh, I know magic god. Generate stamina, resist frost, strength, berserker, defender. And scrolls. Scroll of Mayhem. Go to books. Contract. Amethyst. Then you get the Coral Dragon Claw, which has something that looks like a tree, something that looks like a bird, and something that looks like a bat. Darn it. Alright, let's see what she has. Oh wait, that's mine still. Okay. Uh, party four. Oh yes. Oh wait, no, she doesn't seem to have any. Okay. Well, you really don't have anything, do you? Alright, let's just sell her some more of those mammoth tusks. Alright. Alright, she has no more gold. Let's just get out of here. Alright, so we should have a new quest now. Quest. Um, Yingo's tomb. Where the hell is that? Oh yes, a new, a whole bunch of new, um, new things were added into the game because of a mod that I added, uh, it's mainly some new dungeons that I've heard were pretty good. Where the hell is Yingal's chamber? Was that the thing that I was just at? With the scourge, definitely scourge, or Droger scourge, or whatever it is. 
chicken egg. Maybe it's up here. Who knows? Suck the bow there. If it is good on me, if it's not, oh well. I'm exploring. Oh yeah, it's up here, I think. If it is actually this one, I'm gonna laugh. Yingal's Chamber. Oh, shoot. Tundra woke up yet. See, there's another one of these new things that are out. Somebody's coming upstairs. Hope you don't talk to me. Because that'd be really weird. I'm talking to myself and they just start talking to me. That would that'd just be awkward for both of us. Then. Oh my god, um, what is even down there? There are a lot of dungeons down here. Anyways, we're making our way back to White Run, which is down that way anyways, so. Oh, there's a quest here apparently. Yes, yeah, so if you looked up in the corner there, there are quests attached to places that I can now see because of a mod called Quest Activator, I think, or like, Knowledge Quest or something. Okay, there we go. It pretty much means that whenever I walk into a place, it tells me if there's a quest there or not. It's actually pretty useful. Okay. So there's a quest here at the College of Winterhold. What the fuck is this place? Um... Requires key. I'm guessing there's not a key around here, it's probably part of the quest. Okay, let's uh, move on. Ah, uh, the fact that you're a stupid butthole. That's what's the hurry. Yeah, okay, we've got to go all the way over here to get to Snowpoint Beacon, so I don't think I'm going there just yet. Ooh, that is the wrong, wrong button. Oh god, oh. Wait a minute, gosh, why is that here? I can't even seem to hit the pitch. Vandal! That's gonna explode. Oh, fire salts. That's wonderful. Anyways, is there something up here, or is my eyes playing mean, mean tricks on me again? Yeah, that seems like it's right up here. Oh, there's a bear! Oh, it's just a bear cub. Apparently still freaking tough as nails. Paint up! Paint up! Paint up! Paint up! Okay. God damn it, I am way too far off. I don't even think I could handle a freaking dragon right about now. Oh wait, I won't fight one, will I? I don't want to go into Dwemer Ruins either, but I do need to get out of this pit. Okay. Oh wait, no, it's cute. Crap, and I have no potions of healing left, pretty much. Whose who's bright idea was this? Oh, here, look, it's up here. I can barely tell the EMB is on. Like, it, it, I guess my eyes just got used to it, but it definitely does look a lot different in, like, the night. The night. Alter Fred discovered or something. Oh, look at that. 
Okay, pause if you want to read this. Sheet feathers live. Okay, no, it wasn't even that big. So here, chest of death. So yeah, I'm. If I die to anything that isn't a dungeon boss, which is very likely at this point in the game, um, and very later in the game because I got a whole bunch of mods that make the game a lot more difficult. Um, if I do happen to die to something, I will completely start over from the very beginning, hold it behind a different character, new different abilities, different race, different everything, until I run out of ideas or just get tired and decide not to do it. Because both, both options are very likely to happen. Is there even anything up there? Probably not. Yeah, let's go down here and see what's up. Uh, I don't even know if I want to go into a Dwemer ruin. This could be dangerous. Both things want to murder me. Oh, apparently I'm going in anyways. Ooh, my butthole so clenched. I can't believe I already died, though. I'm like seven episodes in or something, and I already died once. Fade up. Yeah, you can definitely tell when I'm in caves, just the darkness of everything. And the contrast and all that stuff, all that great, great stuff. Ooh, dwarven metal. There's some wheat, so now if I have some giant toes, I can make health potions. Hello. Sauras Journal. Okay, that's really short, so I'm just going to... We tried to get through the glacier at the top, but we couldn't find any way to get to the tower par parapet. Yeg spotted the glacier wall and the catwalks and finished with time to storm the hit. I heard she thought to wait on, but it got worse. The shit took several labors. I ordered everyone to clean the moon and supplies. Looks like we are well and truly stuck in here. But for all that I feel, you're more driven than I should. Okay. Oh my god, everything is so dark in here. I have no idea what's going on. Oh my god. This is so much better than regular Skyrim, where everything's like bright and light lit up and everything's... Oh look, a loot. I want that empty wine bottle. Ooh. Uh, okay, don't, don't care. There's a shovel. I don't need a shovel. Shovels are for wimps. Ooh, oh, there's a shovel. There's another shovel, apparently. Uh, okay, there's probably nothing here. Ah, uh, I really wish I had, like, a torch or something. Items. Miscellaneous. Okay, there's no torch here. Ah, uh, this is where I wish I had a pit boy light. <laughs> there's a lot of blood here. Somebody had one really, really bad period, apparently. Where is it? I know you were trying to keep it for yourself, Cesar. You always try to keep it for yourself. No, there's got to be more school. Shut up. Shut up. Don't lie to me, Cesar. Always try to what the fuck? That guy is batshit insane. Okay. Okay. What the hell is down here and why should I care? At least it's getting a little bit lighter. Oh, look, Dwemer robots. That's the only part of the song I know. Oh, okay, there's a lot of stuff in here. I'm going to take the soul gem. Spider. Let's just take everything. I don't even care. Oh, jump fragment. Uh, Research notes. 
Not important. That is really small writing and I don't care to read it. Search chest. Ooh. Taking those. That was my baby. Oh! Now I have a torch at least. Oh look, I can sit there. Yeah, you can definitely see like the extra shading that comes off the lights and stuff. Oh, it's, it's great, honestly, this EMB thing that I got. Do I just have like shorter healing than the rest of the races? Because I specifically remember being better than this, or healing faster than this on other characters. Faindel, are you are you okay yet? Did you did Faindel really die? Faindel can't be dead. He can't be. That was one hit. Items. Faindel, uh, our torch, 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 torch. Okay. Holy shit, he is dead. Alright, I guess. Oh. That's sad. I didn't think Fandel would die that easily. Oh. It's really bad. All of my leftover arrows. Okay. Torch. Already have pickaxe. Don't really need anything else. Okay, keep moving. Okay, I. This is where I heard the other guys talking from back there, so he must be down here? Being all crazy and stiff? Oh, sh Oh, that one's electric. At least it's not doing most damage to my freaking mana. Almost level 11. Oh, I took. Okay, I've got to be a lot more careful, apparently. Alright. This is when I wish I was a Khajiit and had those eye things that made me see in the dark. Who is this brother? Another of the smooth skins looking for food? No! No! That's not how it works. You die to me. That's how it works. Stupid. Oh, 
I can't even see him. It is so freaking dark. Okay. Yeah, this kind of does suck. I'm not gonna lie. Alright. Okay, of course I can go up to more smithing and get that advanced armor. I just don't really want to do that, though. Okay, let's go up to one of my archery or light armor or something. I'll just save the perk then. Right helmet. That very sense. And of course his brother is dead. Jazar. Had nothing. Has a woodcutter's axe. Oh, plentiful healing. Empty skooma bottle healing. Jazar's journal. Okay, I'm not even going to read that or try to. Take quill. Boots. Coin purse. Wait, that wasn't a coin purse. Okay, apparently we're still just running along in this dungeon here. That's good. This looks like a place where something is just gonna pop out and start attacking me. Oh shit, what is that? Safe. Cause that's what I think it is. Okay, that's a centurion. I don't know if I'm gonna be able to even attack that. I'm dealing damage to it as of right now, but I think that's gonna murder me. I really need a companion who can hold a torch. He's really slow, luckily. Move backwards and keep firing. Ah, the power of wailing about. Oh god. Oh god. Okay. Gyro core. Grand. Okay. Okay, there we go. That was great. Oh, apparently I could have done other things too, like something. Okay, these look like they drop things and shoot things out at me. That one looks like it's still full, so I'm guessing I'm gonna get attacked here. Um, we're at half an hour, but I'm gonna keep going. Oh. Is this something up there? I can't even see items. Oh, okay, where's the torches? Oh, okay. Metal ingot, road of strength, boss emerald, potion, plentiful healing, 
chest. Whoa, okay. That. Oh, it's me. Fashion healing, Archika. Oh, wait. I can probably drop a lot of those things. Okay. Let's go here, and I want to keep that, because I can sell that. Ah, oh, God. God, that. If I'm gonna sell that and disenchant that, I can... I can definitely get rid of that. I want to disenchant those, and I want to keep that. Okay, that doesn't really matter. Okay, apparel, of course. I'm going to have to get rid of this leather armor. Okay, apparently still carrying way too much. I don't even know how. Oh, food. Oh, it's probably all these stupid... There we go. Oh, that has weight of 10. Those don't weigh or value anything, so... Oh, that's 55 of those, so that's taking up 55 right there. Okay, let's get rid of the kettle. Holy crap. Okay, that got rid of it right there. Oh! Oh, there was fire here. Oh, God. Oh, okay. Okay. Crap. Yeah. Okay. How many are there? How many are there? Just those two, I'd assume. Oh my god, this... That's not... Oh god. I don't... I don't like you. I don't like you. I thought I was something better than this. Oh, okay. But first off, let's get some healing out there. Okay. 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 Wait, how tough am I at? Okay. Yeah, let's just use one of those. Okay, that was great. Hold on, iron ore. Oh wait, of an oil, or Dwemer oil, or whatever you want to call it. No, okay. Okay, no, and that's where they came out of, little buggers. Oh wait, where's my arrow? Okay. That centurion was definitely not a boss, by the way. Just so if I had to die there, you know. Ow. God damn it. Item. Oh, 
items. Come for healing. Oh my god, I'm probably gonna have to run away from here. This stupid place. See if I can get this. Alright. Let's see, as long as I can get an eye on them first, I should be able to do this. Just sneak off and destroy them. But the problem is, most of them pop out of these things in the walls that I can't see. Oh, cute. Sorry. Plentiful healing, plentiful stamina, and I can sleep. Enter, yes. Oh, yeah, I can heal. Full health, bitch. Okay. Kind of don't want to blow up. Doesn't look like there's anything down there, anyways. Alright, let's go this way. Okay, apprentice. Oh no! No! No, I'm, I'm dead! No! No! Twice in, in one episode. Twice in one god damn episode. First me, then faint all, then me again. No. Oh no. No, I, oh, I have to start all over again. No. No. I, oh. God damn it. Alright, guys. I'll see you later. See you next time. Fuck my life. <laughs> this is the last time we stand here looking at the sexiness before us. That is Vilgrass. The elf hunter. Goodbye and good night, everyone. Goodbye and good night.